Edrotech Tip Quick and Easy Agarose Gel Preparation Molecular biologists study the molecules of life, DNA, RNA, and protein, and how they interact within a cell and an organism. Basic techniques like molecular cloning allow researchers to cut, manipulate, and paste DNA to better study it in vitro. Every day, in research labs around the world, scientists use electrophoresis to analyze their DNA of interest. This technique uses electricity and a porous gel matrix to separate nucleic acid into discrete zones or bands, based on physical properties like charge, shape, and size. The gel matrix we use to separate molecules in many of our experiments is agarose, a seaweed polysaccharide. The agarose acts like a strainer or molecular sieve, helping us to separate molecules by size. The first step to running agarose gel electrophoresis is creating the gel. This step is the equivalent of making a scientific jello mold. Agarose is a powder which is added to electrophoresis buffer and heated to boiling so that it dissolves. As the solution cools, it solidifies, taking the shape of its container. Therefore, we cast the agarose gel using a mold so that the gel fits into our chamber. So how do we heat the powdered agarose solution to boiling? We can use a microwave or a stirring hot plate, but they can be costly and can cause the agarose solution to boil over and create a mess. Stretch your lab budget with an easy, inexpensive alternative, a rice cooker. Small personal rice cookers can be purchased from most retailers for around $15. Rice cookers use electricity to heat their contents to high temperatures, perfect for melting agarose. To use the rice cooker to prepare your gel, First, measure your diluted electrophoresis buffer and your agarose powder and place it into the vessel. Close the lid, plug in your rice cooker and turn it on. Within 5-10 to 10 minutes, your solution should be boiling. Turn off your rice cooker and allow the molten agarose to cool to 60 degrees Celsius. At this point, the solution is cool enough to add cyber-safe stain, if needed for your experiment, before pouring your gel. So, do you want to prepare gels in your classroom, but you're on a tight budget? Invest in a personal rice cooker to melt your agarose.